Hi Libra, how's it going? I hope you're doing great. This is for Libra. Sun, moon or rising sign. I want to thank you so much for your support to my channel. Because I be begun this channel with um, market as Libra readings, you know, but probably you have noticed I've changed my channel a little bit because I want to take all the the star signs uh, day by day, you know, and so this a week I have uh, readings for Capricorn, Gemini, Sagittarius and Pisces and next week is going to be Libra, Taurus, Aries and Cancer and the next week after that is going to be Virgo, Aquarius, Leo and Scorpio uh, because uh, I want to reach out to as many people as possible and I suddenly realized I don't do this for money, you know. <laughs> I don't do it for clout or money, you know. I do it because I have this urge to, to tell people the truth, you know. So that's why I do it. Uh, and I have this job, um, my regular job, you know, which I work. Uh, long hours, morning, evenings, and nights, you know. So I try to take my day, my days, which I'm off, you know, to, to, to make readings. And uh, today I am off work, and today is my birthday as well. <laughs> so this is your birthday reading for you, Libra, today. Um, yeah. Libra energy, please. Libra energy. Birthday reading for Libra. What is happening in Libra's life? The Hermit. The Page of Swords. And the Two of Wands. Someone is watching you or someone is going to call you. Someone has been in the, some soul searching because of you, Libra. They have been through some heartbreak. Queen of Pentacles. Oh, the King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. Who is this? This is a couple coming together with the same ideas, the same Values, that's what I'm hearing. Same values. Two of Pentacles. The High Priestess. Six of Cups. Yeah, someone is uh, thinking about the past and what they did to you. Your childhood, perhaps, in what happened in childhood. Yeah. Think, thinking about, or this can be a uh, ex lover thinking about a new start with you. Two of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands. This is a burden. Something has been a burden. The Judgment. The Two of Wands. This is not looking forward to something. Yeah, someone is in pain, nightmares, uh, can't sleep, insomnia. Because of something that happened in the past or someone is missing you a lot 
someone is missing your love and um, they're reminiscing about what happened in the past um, keeping themselves um, in hermit mode having this heartbreak over you tell me more spirit about the first row the first row The sun in reverse, someone is in depression, sadness, want to have this victory, public recognition, victory, have more self-confidence or they see that you have a lot of confidence. Yeah, they're struggling with their self-worth, living beyond their means perhaps, obsession with work. False success, emotional immaturity, yeah, mm, they, they think about having this long term with you, uh, through hard work, perseverance, diligence, investments, yeah, because uh, they're there is some disharmony in this person's life. There's some imbalance. There was some misalignment of values. You didn't have the same values. So now they're suffering because of their past indecision and fear of commitment. Uh -huh. So this is someone who want this video they want uh, equal give and take because this is a couple that belongs together that's how i read this their intuition is telling them you are the soulmate or something like that but they juggled you with someone else or this is or this is they are very uncertain on what to do. The middle row, please. This is the king of wands. The natural leader, the visionary, overcoming challenges, mature energy, you know. Yeah, someone accept that you are moving on now. I, I have this feeling they accept that you are moving on. They accept that you don't want nothing to do with them anymore they need to forgive themselves don't want conflict Res they respect the differences between you agreeing to disagree this can be a, an ex of yours <clears throat> or someone in your family perhaps that um, agree to disagree huh? Yeah, they see that you have a lot of respect. You are you are very stable. You are very structured. You have this uh, inner authority. You have this balance between the feminine and the masculine, uh -huh. because you have um, experienced so much. And someone is. In conflict because of this, because of your self confidence, because of your, because of your social approval, because of because of your wisdom and trust, you know, you are, you, people can trust you. Mm -hmm. so moving away from the disappointments. This self-limiting beliefs, this inner critic, or the need to, they do this, or the need to do this. This is a challenge for them. They put you in a competition. Um, if this were a past lover, they could put you in a competition. They competed with the, they loved, uh, with whom they loved. Uh, and 
this is an upheaval of uh, of thoughts, uh, the chaos, the revelation of of this knowledge, acknowledging of something, sudden insight of something, awakening to something. Yeah, the page in the reverse, the page of thoughts, deception, manipulation, all talk and haste. Haphazard actions, self-expression, um, the resistance to change. You know? They know that you know. <laughs> they know that you know. So this is causing them a lot of um, anxiety. You know? Worry and fear, depression, insomnia and things like that. Yeah, the wealth, the financial security, the family, the long-term success, the regrets not taken. Or this is a narcissist who tried to have power, power over you. Uh, Because of their weakness, because of their loss of emotional control, misuse, they misuse the power of you. They think about you as very nurturing, very practical, working hard, you know, this new start. This abundance, this manifestation. I want to be a part of it, but you know, the losing part is the narcissist because they can't, they can change. You know? They can't change. Then they need all the the positive energy from you, you know? but. Um, but there's a limit to what you can give to a narcissist, you know, because uh, you you have come to the point where you you want to give back to people that give the same energy towards you that you gave to them, you know. You don't settle for less anymore. Someone was greedy, someone wanted your energy, someone wanted your bright ways of seeing life. They wanted to be like this, but they can't, you know, because they're in this um, all talk energy, manipulative energy, you know. They, uh, struggle to express themselves, you know, and uh, there was some greediness, there was some overthinking, some protected themselves in some shape or form. Yeah, they're playing, playing small, they think, uh, oh, I'm not uh, uh, worthy of that, I'm not worthy of this and that, you know. So the playing small. They, they can't take the right choice because they don't know themselves. And it causes very much indecision. They don't have the courage. They don't have the strength. As you have, Libra. This unbiased judgment that you have, clear-minded and um, direct communication, they never could um, earn up to that, you know. So there's uh, been a delays, there have been a standstill, there have been resistance. Fear of sacrifice, they didn't want to sacrifice 
something to get to you. And now they're in hermit mode. Yeah, because of unfairness, the lack of uh, accountability, you know, the dishonesty, the punishment. Uh, would uh, they would like to punish you, but uh, in reality they punish themselves. You know? Now they try to get rid of these addictions, this dark dark uh, side of them. You know? Try to free themselves from this dark energy but this is a struggle this is a burden this is hard work they want this wealth and prosperity they are restless to get to their goals they don't see that every step counts you know the abundance you know then there's no rush when it comes to um Keep your life in um, in a good place. You know, you have to have patience. You have to have patience. Anger. Some is very angry because of what happened. Yeah, and the, the 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 thing is, they accuse you of being the ones who left them, but you had no choice. You had to left. You had to leave. You know. You had no choice because of this manipulation, this insecurity, the lack of confidence, this narcissism, you know. So you had no choice. You took the, the, the choice to transform yourself. While they were resistant to change, you know. So the need for self love, you know, it caused this this relationship to stagnant, to be in disharmony, causing breakup, you know, tension, broken communication. You don't talk to this person anymore. You are focusing on your money, you know? they're in lack of motivation. You are in this new project energy, you know? inspiration, desires, new beginnings, new opportunities, and you are very intuitive. You have the sacred knowledge for some of you, for um, a lot of you actually. See, sacred knowledge, trust, you are trust, you trust yourself, you, know? you are in this purity, this high morals, this abundant energy, you, know? you are committed to evolve yourself, you know? very driven, by this this uh, evolution of self you know? while they the, while they are in this um, ten of uh, swords in reverse resisting an inevitable end you know they're resisting the change so therefore there is no change <laughs> negative self-talk as well and lack of inner joy the two caught up in materialism no? their communication is is off you know? someone is in panic because of this because of the they can't work with you anymore, they can't take your energy anymore, they can't interfere because you are too much in your power, you know. So they, they have this financial loss, this emotional loss, worry, poverty, insecurity, while you are in this compassionate, 
calm and nurturing energy. No? You're very stable. Yeah, you take the time to rest as well. No? To, to gain your um, to gain your strength, you know, after a period of hard work, you take the time to to rest as well. Alignment with your personal values, yeah. But while this person was in this fantasy, this illusion, this confusion, you know, now they're contracting the, some bad luck. They think about coming clean, you know, because they love you. That's what they, from their perspective, they love you. But all of these cards don't talk about love, you know. Yeah, because they lie to you. They try to make you confused. To, to have you to take some clouded judgment. Now they're in this. Because they, they were in this alcoholism, you know, this overindulging in alcohol. So the new path was blocked because of this. You know? So now they're in fear. Because you don't want to talk to them, you are silent. Because you want to protect yourself, you know, yeah, you are in this scar, this healing, you healed from this. So, you are also in your purpose, you know? purpose in life, you are sure of yourself. You don't, you don't dwell in the past like this person did, you know. What happened has happened. You can't you can't do anything about what happened in the past, but you can do something about today and your hope for tomorrow. You know, you can change. You have the you have the ability to change at any time. You know, but it's like for people with narcissistic tendencies, it's like they never. They're never going to change because they're stuck in the past or something. Their the brain is stuck stuck in the past, reminiscing about the past, what happened in the past. It's like there's no new uh, thoughts, there's no new development, you know. Yeah, so they're stuck in and um, the lack of balance. Yeah, because, because of all the injustice they did, you know, the unjust things they did, this unfairness, this lack of accountability, this guilt is creating much guilt, you know, this dishonesty and um, they wanted to punish you or something like that because you walked away from them or something. Libra. That was your birthday reading to you. <laughs> I wish you all the best and bye bye.